What's up guys? Today I got into trouble when I set this here. Let me try to show you. Uh, it's on the sun and everything, but if you come here to trigger setup um, and you see this value here, 206, mine was 190 and here was falling. So <clears throat> the trigger wheel, which goes there on the harmonic balancer, it goes like this. And then it was saying if it counts the teeth before or after it passes. So because I changed, it changed the degrees in here. So whatever I was saying on my table, so let me get my table now here. Uh, here. Uh, my timing table, whatever I was saying here, 26 degrees. It was 26 degrees plus whatever was wrong. Luckily, I was wrong for last. So 26 degrees uh, was at, or 28. Uh, it was taking 16 because I changed from 190 to 206. So it was actually adding 10 degrees. Uh, apparently, I made... So apparently, according to the app, uh, it uses speed, RPM, and gear. Um, I made 533 horsepower. Um, now I need to be careful because it got lean. With all this changing, it got lean. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you uh, what you got to do. Because if you run into this problem, you need to connect your computer. And I'm going to show you what I experienced. And you're going to see what you need to do. Alright, so we're running the car. I'm going to get uh, this here. And I'm going to start a log. So you're going to understand why. Start log. The car was all wrong and so you see here on my log you're gonna see how many degrees we're running so see here 13 degrees up there now we get the lights and we put the light in there and it should be around 13 degrees I still I think you can see I'm still like around 10 and going under so I could still pull one more add one more of those degrees in here uh, which is going to give me actually the 12 and 13 uh, yeah look at that it's more like yeah, as you can see right it's more like 9 or 10 so we get in here and we do 208 208 and then boom when I change if you go there there you go so let's change a little more so I'm gonna change to 210 wow it sounds better yeah see now it went back uh, advanced actually it's around 15 so I gotta go less, so let's go 208 again. Yeah, so I guess the 206, 208 is my magic number. Uh, so I'm gonna turn off the car. Woo! Not sure what that was. Oh, the fan kicked in. Um, okay, yeah, that's weird. I don't know. I don't know what I need to do for that, but. So I'm good there. I'm gonna turn off the car. Okay. So it is good, and this is what you gotta do uh, to be sure that your degrees are correct. So don't do like me. If you change this or whenever you're starting, you need that so you know um, what's happening. I can smell gas. So if I can smell gas, that means um, that this is running rich uh, so now we're gonna go inside the car we're gonna get the logs again so I'm gonna stop that guy let me close this I'm gonna compromise on uh, 207 because 206 was good I'm gonna compromise on that and then here we go back in time and then you see the AFR so you see 14, 3, 13, 14. So it's actually very good. 
um, even when I changed, when I changed it was 13, maybe a little rich, so I can go to my VE table, and now we're going to start doing uh, the tuning, so if you get in here, um, I guess I could drop here a notch, I'm going to do like one, two, and um, that should be enough, so yeah, so now we got to run the car, get a log, and do it again. Alright, so I just need to drive around a bit, uh, getting the logs right there, and yeah, with that we are going to uh, uh, come back and see if we have any uh, air fuel ratio problem, now, now my feet is not in the gas or anything, so yeah, I'll be back in a minute. That was a good one. But you gotta check this out. That's the second time this happens. So I will need to get this here and I'm gonna put it here slowly, go home slow. Um, I need to make a uh, now, it's my next thing. I need to put a support right here. And yeah, battery is dying. So that's gonna be it keep rolling and all right so this is uh, one of the first logs I got right after that and as you see is like it's terrible right um, because I drop all this table here which is my ignition table um, because I, I mean just to be safe and you know of course it grabs here and keeps going up and down up and down on the advance um, and he didn't like it, so the car was driving kind of choppy. After this here, um, you can see here, for example, um, I also increased some gas, so we had like 15, 15 AFR here going slow, so I wasn't uh, in actual danger. And you see this side here was telling me what was wrong. The table you see here is the table that I work on already. Um, so yeah, this log is this guy and you know, I did all this process here. So if we get another one in the middle, you can see this green up here is my pool. So probably this is my first gear and you know, first gear from, um, all the way from 4,000 to 7,000 RPM. Uh, it took four seconds and, and this took me to 60 miles per hour. Um, yeah, so the AFR here, it's all much better, it's richer, um, but also too rich is not good. So uh, what I wanna show you with all of this is there is some work you need to do. You gotta retune everything. Um, this is my my last log and is much, 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 much better. Uh, you get here my pools, first gear, just testing, second gear, or there was second and third and then you see here again so there's some areas I still need to work on and see why it's like this uh, but yeah in general uh, just changing the <clears throat> this guy here um, and changing the timing light this here uh, changed everything here um, so one last time just so you understand and sorry my microphone is right on my face here uh, my GoPro when you change this trigger angle right here uh, where my mouse is right um, 
and you put a timing light, you're going to see the zero. And if, if this table here, let's say that this is where we are right now, right? So if you move your, your mouse and let's say this here, I'm on a thousand or 1500 is a, is between 15 and 16. If you look up here, uh, we have 18 degrees, right? If you put a timing light and measure, change the timing light on the back to 18, it should point to zero. If it doesn't point to zero, you have wrong timing. So then you need to come here and change this guy again. So that's how we fixed it. But you need also to remember if you're running wrong, like I was, and this is five degrees retarded and you're advancing 10, you're actually only advancing five. So be sure you don't explode your engine when you change this. Uh, watch this video again. Watch again the timing light part. Uh, this is important. And I mean, I luckily, problem I had was uh, it retarded instead of advancing more because it could be a big problem. So I hope it. I hope this video uh, helps you um, somehow. Um, leave a little comment here if you have anything to say. If you have any questions to ask. Uh, I'll be glad to answer. I answered that very quickly. Uh, don't forget to leave that little thumbs up and share the video. That Those are the things that help me the most. Subscribing is always uh, the best way for you to uh, keep track on all of my builds and all that stuff. Um, I lost my camera, broke it, um, having a new camera. So, yeah, the videos are going to come back uh, better again in three to five days so stick around and i'll catch you later look past my face see status i'm eating some mcdonald's